providing an opportunity to reflect deeply on the relationship between fundamental rights and democratic freedoms, our collective aspirations for prosperity, and efforts to secure opportunities for all, and the imperative to advance national sovereignty and the security of the state. In this discourse, the people of Kenya have expressed their views on governance, development, economic management, national finances, and many other aspects of our nationhood. It is of utmost importance that the government takes measures to affirm our commitment to actualizing the people's aspirations, assure citizens that the state exists to serve them efficiently and with integrity, and to signal to all that our national values and principles of governance are the foundation of our national dispensation. The issues that have come to the fore requiring expeditious attention as matters of urgent priority include an accelerated program to significantly increase our food production and agricultural sector development in addition to the interventions that we already have so as to reduce the cost of living and enhance food security in our country. And together with it, to provide requisite raw materials for our agro, our value addition, our manufacturing, and our industrialization agenda. The need to expand existing job creation opportunities and programs and to create new interventions to address unemployment in order to absorb thousands of unemployed young people and provide them with gainful employment opportunities. The necessity of a public conversation on innovative, prudent, transparent and accountable use of public resources along with people-friendly mechanisms for domestic resource mobilization and reducing public expenditure in a manner to make sure that we live within our means. Number four, the imperative of addressing the significant challenge of public debt by establishing and implementing very clear mechanisms to reduce public borrowing and insulate the country from risks associated with debt accumulation, including prudent financial management to avoid debt distress. The importance of constituting a more inclusive government that unlocks the potential of citizens from all sectors to drive our national transformation and our unity. I gave the nation my undertaking to reflect at length on these issues that have been brought into sharp focus by the people of Kenya. I also promised to consult widely on the way forward, and I also promised to craft a broad-based government that would harness the enormous potential in our country to turbocharge our economic transformation and to provide for inclusive growth. While the events of the past one month have caused tremendous anxiety concern and uncertainty, the crisis has presented us with a greater opportunity as a nation to craft a broad-based and inclusive citizen coalition for national transformation and progress made up of all Kenyans from all walks of life. It cannot be denied that our nation has been in a crisis caused
caused by multiple and complex factors. Neither can we turn away from recognizing that the opportunity before us is greater than the crisis. Together, 